how to install official lineage os 18.1 based on android 11 on the poco f3 the mi 11x or the redmi k40 oh well 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 finally 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 official lineage os 18.1 based on android 11 is available for the poco f3 the mi 11x or the redmi k40 and in this video we are going to install it now what are the prerequisites for this video well for starters you do need to have an unlocked bootloader and you need to have twrp recovery installed yep you can install this using twrp recovery and we are going to use the twrp recovery by washisht how do you unlock the bootloader how do you install twrp recovery videos for those can be found in the description of this video next thing make sure your battery is charged at least 50 to 60 percent do not and i repeat do not do this process if your battery is at 20 or 30 percent also make sure you have a backup of all your pictures videos and anything important which you have on your device because we are going to perform a format data and you are going to lose all your pictures, videos and anything important which you have on your device. Next thing you are going to ask me is do I need to come from stock MIUI? Well coming from stock MIUI is always recommended but in case you are not on stock MIUI and you are on any other custom ROM as long as you know that you have Android 11 firmware installed on your device you should be good to switch between custom ROMs using TWRP recovery except for one special custom ROM which would of course need you to go back to stock me ui and that custom rom would be mentioned in the pinned comment on this video so again make sure you do read the pinned comment on this video next up what are the files which you need now all the files which you need along with all the telegram groups telegram channels everything is linked in the description of the video so you do need the rom file itself which is your lineage os do note lineage os does not come with google apps baked in so you have to install them explicitly in case you want google apps if you do not want Want Google Apps feel free to skip the part of installing Google Apps but format data will still be needed now which Google Apps are going to work at the time of recording this video I did try out Nix stock G apps and they did not flash because there wasn't enough space in the system partition so Omni G apps from Nick flashed without any issues however down the line the developers might you know increase the space in system partition so that we are able to flash next stock g apps without any issues and you can of course try to flash multiple g apps in one installation process without any issues or the risk of breaking your device and that is shown later in this video and for full disclosure i do have the international variant of the mi 11x which is known as the poco f3 however the process will work even if you are on the chinese variant which is your 8pk40 or the indian variant which is your xiaomi mi 11x and i had stock me ui installed before i installed this rom so that is what we are going to use in this video so here it is i am running the miui 12.5.1 stable based on android 11 on my poco f3 and as i mentioned earlier in the video the process will work even if you have the indian variant of the poco f3 which is the mi 11x or the chinese variant which is the redmi k40 next up you can go into settings password and security remove your screen lock fingerprint and face unlock once that is done go back go into me account and remove your me account once that is done go back go into accounts and sync and remove your google account once you have removed all the accounts and security measures make sure you reboot your device once now why are we removing all the accounts and security measures we are doing this because we are going from one rom to another and i don't want you to be locked out of your own device next thing we need to do is we need to boot into our custom recovery which is twrp so first of all turn off your device once the device is turned off press and hold power and volume up together and then once you feel the vibration or see the poco logo felt the vibration let go of the power button and keep volume up pressed you should boot into your custom recovery which is twrp 
so here it is we are in twrp first of all we will go into wipe advanced wipe just select dalvik and then swipe to wipe once that is done tap on the home button go into install now you need to navigate to the folder where you have downloaded the rom which is your lineage os and your google apps in case you want to install google apps so if you downloaded the files on your phone directly they will be in the download folder if you transferred them manually you would know the location let us go into download and here it is first of all select the rom itself which is your lineage os official build do note we are using a nightly build in this video because that is the one which is available also make sure that inject twrp after install is checked again make sure that inject twrp after install is checked and then swipe to confirm flash if you do not check the option of inject twrp after install your recovery might be replaced now once lineage os has flashed successfully we need to make sure there were no errors so here it is flashing the rom step one of two step two of two no errors and then we have two lines in red which can be ignored because this is the step wherein we are making sure that twrp is not replaced so we got image flash completed image flash completed and there were no errors tap on the home button go into install now those of you who want to install g apps we are going to do that right now and before you ask me why do i have three different variants well that is because i do not know which one will fit in the system partition because of dynamic partitions so i have three of them the biggest is the stock one of all these three so i am going to try with stock and then try to go back to the previous versions in case the stock one does not work so select your gapps package and again make sure that inject twrp after install is checked and then swipe to confirm flash so as you can see we got error one and if you read the logs it will tell us that storage space is full so installation has failed and we are not able to use the stock g apps now do note this might change down the line because if they expand the system partition then you should be good anyways no need to panic twrp is still there because you got image flash completed image flash completed we can go back to the home screen go into install and let us try the next smallest size available which is your omni g apps and again make sure inject twrp after install is checked and then swipe to confirm flash and while it is backing up our twrp and restoring it you will notice this time we got no errors so there was nothing in red no error one or nothing like that when we installed our g apps so g apps were installed without any issues here it is no errors and nothing like that now the step of backing up your twrp is also done so ignore the lines in red and image flash completed image flash completed so we can tap on the home button go into reboot and select recovery so we have booted back into twrp we will go into wipe format data type in yes and then tap on the check mark on the bottom right of the keyboard as you can see we are getting some warnings or errors about unable to mount something in data recovery those can be ignored and of course format data will result in wiping out of all your pictures videos and anything important which you have on your device so make sure you do have a backup of all those things and we got some more errors about unable to mount some partitions again those can also be ignored because format data was done or performed without any errors all you need to do here is reboot into system and what do we have here lineage os boot animation on the poco f3 the mi 11x or the redmi k40 of course the first boot up might take some time so you have to be patient and there it is we are on the setup screen and let me skip the initial setup real quick and we are on the home screen i do see google play store which means google apps were flashed without any issues let us go into settings and then you can go into about phone and here and if i tap on the android version bam here it is official lineage os based on android 11 installed successfully on the poco f3 the mi 11x or the redmi k40 whatever you want to call it and that will do it for this video Hope my video helped you. Likes, shares and subscribes are appreciated. Feedback and comment more than welcome. See you when I see you.